So this is the big black stud that we got, kind of a rescue thing. We're trying to figure out nobody, when they acquired them, no information came with them. So, and uh, we're going to see what, what they are like. See if they've had their feet, you know, it's obviously he's had his feet picked up before and he's been brushed before. And uh, so this horse may end up being decent one once we get him back into shape and get him cut. No, once you get him castrated. And anyways, he, he may end up being a decent little horse for something. So anyways, we're going to throw a saddle on him, see what happens. You want to see if he's had a saddle on before. You can kind of tell as you start approaching with him on things. He doesn't even seem to be bothered by it. Yeah. Well, very highly likely that this horse has been ridden before. So somebody spent some time with him. Uh, Did you try to ride mm -hmm. today? Go get some reins, Johnny. Once you get a saddle on, you can't stop there. Yeah. He's pretty good size. He's probably about the same. Just just get things on and then adjust adjust it. Yeah. He's got a big old barrel chest on him. No, he doesn't. He's probably hasn't been ridden in a while. We'll have to hand stuff around to you. That way you don't, he doesn't get nutty and break stuff. I wouldn't go under him. But you go around him, behind him. That's a good boy. No. He hasn't even tried to kick us. I just tried to brush him. He'll be fine. Just pat his butt. Yep. He's been worked with before. <clears throat> Curtis, come put the brush strap on as he hands it around to you. Oh, right there. Grab that. Huh? Go ahead. Come around. He'll be fine. Go ahead, Z. He's had a saddle on before. You think he's ever been ridden? Yeah, I think he has. People don't just put saddles on them and then turn them loose. You know what I mean? Some people raise good. Make that side up. Yeah. Well, you're only this far from the ring. Yeah, I'm this far right now, and I'm not trying. Okay. Come here, Curtis. Or Johnny. Someone come and video. Georgie, you can video. Talk about what we're doing. So, we're saddling up the, the big black horse. Well, what are we going to call this horse? There you go. He hasn't. He's big for the herd that he's been in, but he ain't very big. What do you think we're going to call this horse, Dad? Well, I don't know. Probably black. That's how it usually goes. I don't really want to keep him. But if we can get him to where he looks decent. Please. Where's that brush at? Let me see that. If they're, if they're broke to ride and stuff, you keep them, fatten them up, and find a good home for them, you know? And just get them treated right. You want to hand this thing around? But you can tell he's been messed with. I mean, man it hasn't been messed with in a while. And his attitude will change completely once he's castrated. 
you know? Mm-hmm. What if he got castrated and they just grew back? Oh, that would be like, that'd be everybody's dream. Have a horse that could regenerate. So you break him, and then before you break him, you cut him. Then you break him, then he grows back his testicles. Yeah, it's kind of hard to do that. <laughs> so Brandon's over there trying to figure out how to long time of year open, open the gate. <laughs> That's funny. Huh. And he does got a line down his back. He's a line back. See that? Mm -hmm. Alright, see if he takes a bit. Yeah, this is going to be the fun part. I bet he does. I bet he takes a bit right away. Should nom, we take nom, off nom. one of his halters? Yeah. Um, nom 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 nom. Eat it. Um, nom 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 nom. See what I mean? Mm -hmm. Just takes it yep. just fine. That's what I'm saying. He's, he's, he's been ridden. Somebody spent some time with this horse. Yep. I don't think this would be the horse you would just turn out unless you had to. If I had to, I can't take feet anymore. <laughs> you need to back up so we can see it. See what he's all about. Look at that guy. Well, this is part of rescuing horses. Sometimes people get horses from other people and they don't know what they're like. They don't know what they're doing, you know, because they just, they get them, buy them, or someone gives them to them and says, hey, I can't feed them anymore. And then they get passed along. And uh, then when we end up with them, we're going to see what they're about, you know. So let's do some up downs. Put some weight in that saddle, see what happens. I want to tighten it up a little better. Yeah, it's tight. Just don't make sure make sure you don't go flying into the thing. I don't want him flying into me. He's not going to. Okay. All right, buddy. Come here. Come here. Come on. Come on. Walk him around. Yeah, that's fine. So he's been brushed, though. I mean, he's obviously been brushed. He's obviously been saddled. See what he got. See what he has. Let's lunge him a little bit. <coughs> he doesn't know how to lunge. I'll try and do that earlier. Curtis, will you put that thing out there with that other one, maybe? You and Johnny? He doesn't want to buck. You know that? He's already licking his lips, son. This is not new to him. It's just new right now. Huh, George? Yep. Go help him, buddy. <laughs> I think he's broke. Mm -hmm. At least green broke. Here you go. Do you think we're going to get a new broke horse? Oh, he's broke, I promise. He might buck a little bit, but...
That's normal. He's, he's new to all of us. He's new to us. He hasn't. He hasn't done it in probably half a year. At least. At least. Or more, huh? So he's putting his foot in the stirrup, and he'll put some weight in it, and if he, and then he'll let it loose for pressure and release, and every time he'll, he'll be up there for a little longer until he can s sit up there and ride him. So at first he was moving away, and I'd go put my foot in there. I keep my foot in there, and when he'd stop, I took it out to tell him that he'll get relief if he doesn't move. And then each time I progress, stand up here, feeling good, I'll go back down, tell him good job. I'll do the same thing on the other side, and then go back and forth on top of him. But I think this has been done with him before. Either this or something similar, huh? Yeah. Seems like someone that got on on the right side. Did Tighten that uh, breast collar up on that side. I'll loosen it one notch over here. He's definitely been messed with, huh? Yep. <coughs> Seems like he's better on his right side. He does, huh? It's like... Whoever trained him at first was getting on on the right side or something. Well, and he's, he's been kicked around. It was probably broke and took care of for, you know, three, four years. And then someone couldn't afford him and start pedaling him off. And people don't, you know, turn him out to pasture and this and that. And, and they end up not being touched for a while, you know. Mm-hmm. George, get up so in case he blows up, you can get out of the way. Good boy. So he's still a stud, and this is pretty dang good, pretty calm for a stud. Hasn't been messed with for a long time to be in this position, and so I would say he's been messed with. Mm-hmm. Don't you agree? Yeah. Okay. May give us give him his like you said, just go one way or the other there, all this kinda Does he neck ring? It's really good for a stud that hasn't been out on, that hasn't been messed with for a while.
I don't think so. Hey Shrek, look at me. Hey Shrek, come here. He's got like a, like a big spot about like yay big on the top and then it like about that thing going all the way down to his nose. Wonder what he'll do running. All right, well, that was pretty good, Ponzi. Yeah, that's surprising. Yeah. I was not expecting that. Nobody was. Were you expecting that? Were you expecting that? I wasn't expecting it. Is it were you expecting that? Yeah, I was. For real? Tell the future, yeah. Tell the future. Let's get a lead rope on him and get him unsaddled. So. For real? All right, guys. First ride on the big black. First step to being rehomed and becoming a somebody else's project horse, you know? What do you think? You could sell him to the ranch. All right, sounds good. So this is the gray stud that we got. He's about three, three years old. We're getting him ready to go get castrated, but we're gonna see what he's made of first. See if he's been saddled and see if he handles the saddle and stuff too, just like we did with the black horse, so. Anyways, we're going to be working here, trying to figure this out. <laughs> All right. Georgie, what's your predictions on this one? Come here. All right, George, what's your predictions on this gray stud? Uh, so, he was the one that let me pet him the most, and he's the friendliest, I think. Yeah, so what's your prediction about saddling him? I don't know. Do you know what a prediction is? No. What do you think is going to happen? What If you have to think about what's he going to do, is he going to throw a fit? Is he going to just be like, yep, I'm going to be able to jump right on him? Uh, or So predicting is you're, you're telling me what the future holds for him when he put a saddle on him. I think probably this... A little like not uh, not act up like just get kind of wide eyed. Just get wide eyed. You think so? Yeah. Okay. So your prediction is that he's just gonna get wide eyed, but be nice, huh? Mhm. Mm Johnny, what's your prediction? I say he's gonna saddle just fine, and then I think he might neck rain. I don't know. 
He might. <laughs> oh, might neck rain, huh? Mm -hmm. All right. What about you guys? Any predictions? No. No? Z? Hey, yeah, help him with the saddle blanket. Bet you he'll saddle right up. Yeah, probably. Let's see. I think so. You tell me if he gets wide-eyed, George. I don't know how to say. When they get wide-eyed, it's like what? They go, ooh. And their eyes, not the white ring of their eyes, will show. Yeah. Will show or show? Will. They don't squint. They get big-eyed. You can barely see them here. You got to look at him up here. He's not wide eyed right now. Not yet. <clears throat> Maybe when we start cinching the cinching. He's licking his lips in approval already, though. He's like, yep. Cool. Grab a hold of that, Curtis. He knows what's going up. Hopefully. Got, how much you got over there? F uh, uh, 12, 13 inches. Yeah. Well, I got two. Right well, he's not bigger than that other horse. I don't think. Well, that feels about right for all here. We got about eight inches. Let's go. Let's just set you up and see. That's how you do it. I think he won't get uh, right eyed anymore. I don't think so. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the next part, the next big part is him getting cinched up. <coughs> you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. well, I getting know. it tight on him. Yeah, I'd say go up on the other side. No at all. <laughs> oh, he did good. He was talking. <laughs> was he? Let's see. I get over here. Well, yeah. Please don't hurt me. That's what he probably said. So we wanted to see what he's about. See if it's a horse that... Uh, what work where we have to start with him so there he's dancing a little bit not let's go get all those ropes over there guys picked up on the ground he's not wide eyed no he's not i think he's been saddled before oh, yeah. george. george make sure he did they didn't twist that up okay does that look good on that side buddy yeah okay hey, i'm gonna call him Oreo Blizzard. Oreo Blizzard? Yes. He does kind of look like an Oreo Blizzard, don't he? Yeah. Oreo Blizzard. Hmm. This is Oreo Blizzard. Oreo Blizzard, huh? Mm-hmm. Get Oreo Blizzard. And then that's Hot Fudge. Still young. Still moves with you, huh? Yeah. Or just a little. Yeah. Give the range to him. See if he'll take a bit. Well, definitely had a saddle on before, hasn't he? Please don't get yeah, my This is my little door down there. Hey. Don't. Just let him talk to him. There you go. Come tighten this up, Johnny. Oh, it can't. It's already tight as it'll go. Yeah, we gotta oil all of our stuff. You think that trough is done draining yet? Yeah, probably. All right, Johnny, you grab that lead rope for him. Goes out. Well, 
It's childproof. Oh, we forgot to put this chin strap. We need the chin strap. Johnny, pick that lead rope up, please. Thank you, buddy. What is that called? Ch uh, neck strap. Choker strap. We just gotta. Guys, get back, please. Lead him around in a few circles first. He's walking kind of stiff legged with that on there. Not bad. I bet you. He's been ridden. I know Hunter sat on him. Bareback or with the saddle? Bareback. He doesn't know how to go forward, huh? Ground pin worked for him. <clears throat> on that scooter. <laughs> yeah. He hasn't had any neck reining abilities, huh? All right. Well, we know what he's about then. We know where to start with him, huh? Okay. The round pin and the neck reining. Yep. Not bad though. I mean, he's been saddled and real mellow that way. So, what do you think? <laughs> huh? Pretty good. <laughs> Pretty good, yeah. yeah. So, well, we'll get him unsaddled and get him taken care of, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, yep. So I don't cool. Think he ever got white eyes. No, he didn't. No, he did uh, move side to side a bit. He may have got one eye wide eyed. So, help him out with that. But anyways, good job, guys. This is a horse. Uh, we'll have to make a decision what we do with him.